Okay, this is how we uh, manipulate frames here on a package colony to get them to draw it out more efficiently. Somewhat times if you don't move these frames, the uh, hive will just kind of be stagnant a little bit. Now here we're moving the, the this cover like this so that we don't lose the vacuum of that feeder pail. So now we're gonna look at these frames and you're gonna see the frames on the outside, they, they won't be drawing them out, but unless we intercede a little bit, the bees won't uh, draw it out properly. So what we're gonna do is gonna pull out the frames from the outside edges and you'll see they're all new foundation. They really probably haven't done anything with that. And then we'll keep going. We'll go to the next one. Oh, they haven't done anything with that yet. We'll go to the next one. And they still haven't done anything with that yet. And we'll look at this next one. And we'll pull out. Okay, they're working on that one on that side. Now we're going to, on the other side, they are not working on that yet. So we're going to put that one in back in like that. There you go. And then we'll put that in. And then we're going to go through here. And I think maybe they've done more on this other side. And you can see, now this is a medium. And so there's all kinds of cat brood. So we just need to give them to more room to lay. And the way to do that is try to get them to draw that comb out a little better. So we're just going to, so it looks everything's queen right everything looks like with all this brood so we're just gonna slide these over and uh we're gonna slide all these over a little bit and we'll check these outside frames okay let's and then we'll pull out another one we'll just okay so here they're working on this side. So now we're gonna turn this one around. We don't get greedy. And, and now they can work on this, this frame on the other side. And then we're gonna put another, put the empty back in. And then now when we come back in a week, on a weekly inspections, they'll have that one done. And then next week, we're going to, this should be done right here, this frame. So we'll take this frame, as long as there's no brood in there now, we don't wanna take the brood. It should be just honey and pollen. And now we're going to swap it with this one. We'll put this one here that they haven't worked on at all. We're going to put that there. And this one here, honey and pollen, we'll move that out. And we're going to do the same on this. And then as time goes on, they'll draw this frame, the, the box out a little faster then. And, but you don't want to get greedy, though, and, and give them too much empty space because that, that's, that's not good. But that is a, this is a good way to get the bees to draw these out a little bit faster. Now, if we come back next week and we see the, these outside frames are, are rocking really well, maybe we have a, a two more over here that they aren't doing anything with. We may even bring one of them from over there uh, over to this side. So just even if we have to slide all the brood over to uh, make more room on this side, but then we are interceding a little bit, a little better, so that uh, the bees will, will um, so the bees will, uh, will um, draw that out a little faster. Keeping pollen on, on these packaged bees, we wanna keep that pollen on now all the way until into June, just to make sure they got enough and keep that feed on. But that's all there is to kinda making these things draw it out a little faster. Well, thanks for watching.